my friends and welcome back um, let's see day three I believe if I'm not mistaken on Ark Survival PS5 oh what a lucky man am I uh, I gotta say I'm liking it it's it's a little different in the uh, <clears throat> pardon me the share factory of the PS4 compared to the share factory of the PS5 you know, I'm still getting used to that but yeah on the whole, I like it. Anyway, I'm in God mode, as you can tell here, just flying around. I'm just kind of scouting around a bit, seeing about where I'd like to do a, a build, maybe, you know? Um, there's various areas, and they all have their pros and cons, of course. I like the island idea down there. That might be all right. <clears throat> but um, we're not all that close to... Uh, well, hello there. <laughs> All right, man. Here we go. Seems I'm not the only one in God mode here. Now this area here, it's right on the border of the winter biome, and it's got a nice little flat spot right there. Now let that render in, and you can see it proper. But yeah, it's. I mean, it's not exactly flat, flat, but it's not bad. You know, a guy could work with that. Not too bad at all. Find a high spot and kind of work out from there. I see we got a, a nice friendly uh, crocagator over there. And then this area right here, uh, again with the waterfall, but I've done the let's build over the waterfall thing. But however, it is a beautiful area. And if a guy was to build down in the front along the cliff face, maybe, yeah, you know, kind of in there looks fairly smooth-ish and um, what have you. Um, Maybe, like, aesthetically, I, I really like the waterfall there. Um, but then I got to think about, you know, advancing on in the game and how close am I. But, you know, a guy really needs flight. At the end of the day, a guy needs flight, you know. And then uh, you're away. You can camp anywhere you want, do anything you want, you know. So, <clears throat> pardon me. Oh, just getting organized, putting stuff away here. And thinking about uh, maybe going on a road trip, have a little look, see what we got um, on foot, per se. Um, it's all fine going into the God mode and whatnot, but it's not really vanilla. And, I, I, you know, we are trying to play kind of sort of vanilla here, I think, give or take. Actually, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just doing it for shits and giggles, if I'm honest, right? Yeah, what do we got? Oh, blueprint for a jar. And a saddle for, oh, I'm at, yeah, because, you know, I'm going to be <coughs> swimming around in one of those anytime soon. <laughs> Although, hey, it's always good to have, right? You know, put her in the closet for later on. And that is for sure. Yeah, I was out and about and whatnot, and I saw a Dilo and I knocked him out. Turns out he's a little level 10. Then I spotted this bugger. He came in and gave me a snaky little lick and a bit of a bite. In fact, he's actually hurt me. But, uh, yeah, you see he's 115. So now, a little ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo, like that. There you go. So, uh, broken bone symbol down in the bottom right. I got a heel up here, but I got time yet. We'll just kind of get this little fella. Oh, okay, yeah, we'll get you going. Divide up some meat. I don't nothing raw here. I am completely ill prepared for this. But then it wouldn't be me if it were any other way. <laughs> okay, my health is doomed. I that's uh, caught that just in time. <laughs> I'm thinking, give or take. That was right down at the end of. Okay, we got a dilo. Uh -huh. And we'll change your name later, but for now you can be CC. And like that, like that. Oh, another one for the for the family, as it were. Oh, 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 oh what are you? Oh, you don't want to go up there. No, no, that's a mistake. That, don't do that. Don't do that. Look, look, be my friend. Be, ah, Julie. Oh, what's? Oh my, my, my. Oh, I, oh yeah, not good. Okay, let's get rid of this. Okay then, <clears throat> so much for adding that one to the family. <laughs> Made up my uh, my little preserving bin, so I'm gonna put that up here because things are gonna spoil on me if I don't. And then of course I've got to uh, 
make up some spark powder. How's that looking on the outside? No, 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 we don't like that. No, no, no. Alright, come here. Let's try this again. Now, if I line up on you, grab my little preserving box. Now, I should be able to go back. And if I line up with the front of that container box, somewhere around in here, I'm thinking, yeah, that'll do. Now, not showing through. Okay. Oh, there you go. That's about as close as you're going to get without <laughs> making contact. Okie doodle. That's just skin to skin there, man. Okay, so just debating on this guy. That's that, uh, I think, that's that level 30 I saw earlier. And I'm thinking I might just tame that up just so I've got flight and nothing else. If you look up around here, around 60, 40, there's uh, an area up over there that I saw when I was out flying around earlier. Um, but it's it's forest. It's up, you know, right at the redwoods, which at this stage of the game, uh, that could be suicide. <laughs> the redwoods nice in there and whatnot, but every living thing there wants to eat your meaty bits, man. I've done builds in there before, the treehouse builds. And uh, you need to have your levels up for that. <laughs> it's a, it's a, yeah, Huevos El Grande is a muy macho. Ah, over out. Now, these little fellas, they're kind of tricky to tame. I, if I remember right, I think they only eat eggs uh, to tame them. But their, their boost is phenomenal. What they'll do is um, they will speed up uh, the process uh, for eggs for our hatching dinosaurs you know you uh, keep them beside your, your uh, male and females and whatnot and their mates and they'll, uh, it speeds up the, the hatching process and everything else but also too if you're out in the boat in the wild and whatever they'll steal eggs for you and um, they won't get caught you know they don't really draw attention to themselves so you see dino eggs that you want or whatever you can send that little guy in there and uh, it's kind of like a pego that way. He'll go in and steal the egg and boogie back. Okay, now. This is the monkey. Oh, okay. Nice. Well, nice for what it is, I guess. All right, me and you are going to be pals, kiddo. I know it hurts a little bit right now, but honestly, we're going to be good friends here soon. There you go. Nice little. And I know low levels, but like I say, this gives me flight. And then with that, I can go around and scope things that I want to have you. <clears throat> and then I don't feel like I'm kind of cheating because I got God mode on, you know. And besides which, with uh, doing it in vanilla like this, when you get there, you can actually land and, you know, scope the scene out proper. Uh, even start to do a bit of a build if, you know, I want to leave, uh, leave some foundations per se and like that. Okay, just gonna grab some meat here. And that like that. Okay. Come on, little one. Nothing just yet. We're moving right along here. Okay. There you go. A little bit of the old doctor feel good for you. Gonna have a nice little sleep. And you're gonna feel so well rested. You know, the thing you see how uh, her food is full, so it's going to take a while before she'll have a bite. Now, some people will starve them out. How oh, are you running from? What's going on? Yeah. Grr. Yeah, some people will starve them out and let their food bar go way down and then put the food in. And that way, because they're hungry, of course, they'll gobble that up real quick like and it kind of speeds along that taming process as they eat the taming level goes up right but it's been my experience at least and I could be totally wrong on this but it's been my experience that <clears throat> the overall waiting for their food to go down and then giving them the food and whatnot when they're almost full like this one is the process is just as long either way now I suppose if you lucked out you got one that was in dire straits you know 
uber hungry or whatever, then yeah, I can see how it would uh, speed the process up in that way, I guess. Maybe I just didn't think that all the way through. <laughs> but yeah, as far as like doing it to this one or whatever, I don't see uh, any benefit to it. You just gotta, you're playing hurry up and wait anyway. You may as well get stuff accomplished while you're waiting, right? Okay, now I have not got enough chitin to do a saddle. We're going to need a bit more. I got the hide, I got everything else, but I don't have enough to make the saddle. So we're going to go walk about like that and like that. Here we go, here we go. You, you thieving birds. Let's just keep going, man. Can't believe they took my uh, my narcotics and my bolas from me the last encounter that we had. Okay, now I'm looking for. What are you? There's what we want. Come here. Sorry, kiddo, but I need your shell. Oh. Hit my own parasol there, I think. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <coughs> no more dinos. Okay, I better take care of them now. Get them done and out of the way. Like that. There we go. Okay. What are you? This will be a level 10 or something. This my luck again. Oh, no it's not, no it's not. Nice. Now look at me big brain the living snot out of this. See? I'm not using my wooden club for three points. Okay, now I just got to hope I can get this one down before the mola wears off. See, what I could do is put the bow away, grab the bola, and re-bola, then bring the bow out. Ah, there we go, no need. Okay, very good, come on that. Nice. Now, this is a game changer. Yeah, I'm liking this. Yeah, weight levels and all that. You can hear the <coughs> people in the parking lot going out for Sunday brunch here. Sorry about that, guys. I got the door open so uh, so my Lily can go in and out off the balcony. She does like to be outside. Unfortunately, that means the uh, the white noise pollution sometimes is uh, <coughs> well. You know, you live in a village and uh, in an apartment, <laughs> there's going to be noises. <laughs> It's either that or I do it in the wee hours, you know, which I'm up in the wee hours normally anyway, if I'm honest. All right, come on, Thelma. We're going to get a little more tight in here. There we go. Okay. Sorry, kiddo, but I need you. Now that should give us enough to make a saddle now. So that's cool beans. Grab a few more berries here. I don't want to use my narcotics if I don't have to because, well, you know, they're more expensive than narco berries, right? And the berries work just as good. They are a very potent uh, narcotic. Okay, put you on, <coughs> pardon me, on uh, neutral and uh, like that and like that. Okay, there we go. The whole point of grabbing the berries was to grab the berries. <laughs> uh, yeah, welcome to me. Okay, you chew on those there, and that will just make you feel so nice. Just all fuzzy, don't you know? <laughs> yeah, like I say, this is a game changer now, because now I've got a, uh, a flyer that I can take over a distance that's going to be able to carry a little bit of weight at the same time and uh, we can kind of check things out for real because you know I really don't want to be 
been doing the beach bob boogie um, for too too long but you can't really rush it too quickly either you know Alrighty, we're coming along Ooh, nicely nicely give me a few more of those and I think we'll take the raw meat and leave the prime in the hopes that that is gonna get her to tame up a little quicker at least that's my brain working you know if she eats raw meat she's gonna go up x amount of levels if she eats prime meat hypothetically she should go up more levels oh look a mantis i have a saddle for you oh look a megalodon i do not have a saddle for you <laughs> All right, I just wanted to get cooled off a little bit. Uh, you overheat really quick at this point in the game. Um, my fortitude is not where I want it yet, but uh, we'll get there. It's all good. I got to keep remembering it's only day three here. You know, we're kind of booting along at a pretty good pace, if I'm honest. Okay, how we doing here? Coming along nicely. I'm rather excited about this, I have to say. Yeah, there we go. Now, what to call ya? What to call ya? <sighs> oh, I know. Bambi. Yeah, you look like a Bambi. <laughs> At least that's what we'll call you for now. I may change that later on, I don't know. We will, uh, we'll have to see. I am partial to the name. Okay, well, you beautiful, beautiful thing, you. Let's, uh, let's get you home now. We'll take these narco berries. We don't want you taking them. And I'll take my prime meat and I will give you a bunch of that to chew on. Because you are hopefully going to level up fairly often here. Now we'll just get you following. Okay, come on, Delma. Let's take Bambi home, shall we? Eh, Ixiosaurus. Shadows. Seven little... That's another thing, too. You get away from this area here, and hopefully I'll get it to an area where there's not a lot of them. They are a pain. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Oh my, hey, I have a saddle for you. <laughs> yeah, I think we best get out of the water here. We are uh, way too early in the game for messing around with them, I'm thinking. But there you go, we have an Air Force. Not so bad, got two flyers. You know, I was setting up to make a saddle for my first low level there. But uh, here we go, don't you know. Look what I found, peoples. Look what I bought home. Got a buddy for you. All right, now, come on. Try and get you landed here. Okay, now. Where'd you go? Come on. Oh, they can be a bugger to land sometimes. Okay, what if we go all stop? There we go. Where are you? Of course, you're all over here, all hell and gone. Okay, well, anyway, let's go and get a saddle for this one made up, and then we got more control of where we place them, as it were. and a little bit of that and I think we'll uh, grab a little more of the hide and the wood and the thatch and the fiber just grab a little bit of everything yeah where are we saddle Of course, it's always in the last place you look, isn't it? <laughs> All right, let's get this queued up and like that and like that. 
So, we have flight. Oh yeah, this is a good day. Okay. Play the hurry up and wait game here. Alrighty, here we go. Now, let's go down and uh, put this on Bambi and see where the bear poops in the buckwheat, as it were. You gotta level up already, right on. Cool, cool, I'm good with that. Saddle on you, girl. There we go. All right, maiden flight. Ta-da! Oh yeah. Well, there we go. We have achieved flight. I'm liking it. All right. Well, I think, peeps, I'm going to call that here for today. We. Uh, We've made a couple of good leaps and bounds here. I didn't set off to do that, but then I seldom do. You know, it's just the way the game unfolds for me. I start off doing this and then it's like, oh, shiny, look, a squirrel. And off I go in a different direction, right? But as always, from me to you, brightest blessings, peeps, hey, love and light. Go tell somebody you love them, yeah? Make their day better. Okay. Love to all of you. Bye for now. Hope you're having a great day, night, afternoon, doing whatever it is that you're doing. Okay, bye for now. <laughs>